Joe, point CNC. You've got about 20 CNCs in here, all of which seem to be from YMT Technologies. All of them. The YCM, yeah, I mean, it, it must go beyond just a relationship, does it? Um, I mean, where I came from before, I, we had a number of various machines, and YCMs were ones that I liked the most. Um, coming here, when I came here, I walked through the workshop, saw all the machines, saw them all with hide and hang controls, and just thought, you know what, this is the, this is the type of place I want to work. They obviously know their stuff. So what, what do you like about them? The Hayden Hayne, that's familiar on a lot of machine brands, but what about the machine itself? For me, reliability. I mean, not, not in this particular place, but at my old place, we had a 1020 and an 85A, nearly 15 years old, still on their original spindles and motors, and they were running 24-7. Like, that is reliability. Whereas we had a, another brand of machine, which I won't name, where we had a spindle go on it, we, it was a new machine and we had five spindles within the first year. And what about what you're cutting here with the machines? I mean, we can hear the spindles going in the background. Does it matter whether it is just aluminium or do, can you cater for the harder materials too? No, we can, we've, we've got numerous steel jobs on the go here. There's pretty much nothing we can't cut, <laughs> so yeah. which is quite good. A, a very good endorsement for YMT from a, from a machine mechanical perspective what about their support if things do go wrong uh, their support is fantastic if there are problems they're quite happy guiding you through problems over the phone if it's something that they feel you can fix yourselves i mean i know a number of them up there and i've had problems with spindles going out of alignment and things like that and just general errors and they're quite happy to talk you through the parameters over the phone if they can't get out to you and as for their general service within a day or two they're here and when you look at the machine you've got here, the integration of the robotics, has that been handled by them as well? Yeah, the, the entire setup was provided by YMT. They did everything. They set it all up beforehand. I basically sent them the models and the types of things we wanted to produce, and they came up with the solutions and said, this is what we're, we're going to do. Do you think this has worked? Worked very closely with them. And, and this was the end result. And, and has it been a reliable installation? Is this now doing what you wanted it to do to up in your productivity? Yeah, in the, in the last sort of two, three months, it's really come into its own. We've kind of got it doing numerous products now. We've got quick changeovers and it's reliable. We can now leave it and it, we can run it out of hours as well, which is great. What are you going to do once you've filled this space here with another machine and a robot? Are you going to go next door <laughs> or? Maybe. Yeah. Well, I think the general plan, we were, we're certainly going to have to expand again. We came down here less than a year ago and we're full. We've just had to remove one machine in order to fit another one of these in with another robot. So at that rate, another six to eight months, we're going to be out of space. We'll be looking for more space again.